Good morning. It is 11 in the morning and I'm vlogging today. Yeah, there's no plans today. Although I do want to do something outside and I do want to film it because I'm so bad at that. Like I'll vlog my whole day, but then I'll be like, I just got back from the beach in the store and I didn't film at all, but I did do that. It's like, um, yeah. Yeah, that's it. Okay, <laughs> I'm gonna go read outside and I will bring you. Okay. <laughs> for like 20 minutes but I have the urge to go to the beach right now but no one wants to go to the beach with me so I decided that I'm going to bike down to the beach by myself which I've never done before but I've honestly had like the urge to multiple times I'm gonna do it today though okay might swim might not we will see but yeah that's what I'm going to do so I will see you there probably lunch this has been my fixation lunch recently i have not gone a single day without eating it it's freaking delicious they're just like spring rolls and all i put in them is chicken avocado cucumber and carrot and it's so good they're especially good with fresh mint but i don't have any of that and i'm gonna watch youtube and chill Good morning. It is the next day and it's 10 in the morning. Um, I kind of just stopped filming yesterday out of nowhere. I don't know what happened. <laughs> I just like forgot I was filming, but I'm gonna just pick it up today. Right now our cleaning lady's here. So I'm just in my room drinking my coffee. Also, I deep cleaned my room the other day and there's really like nothing to clean right now. She's probably just gonna like mop my floor. That's it. Like, I also made my bed. I used to never have my room clean. Like, a couple years ago, you literally couldn't see the floor. It was so bad. And I don't know how I lived like that. It's shocking that I did that. Yeah, nothing on the agenda today. I'm just gonna take you along my day. Oh my god, that coffee is so yummy. <laughs> okay, hello. First of all, the cleaning lady is gone. My room is mopped. But I have a goal today. Okay, so as we might know i don't actually know if i talked about it in this video but i found this kindle the other day it's been in our family for like 10 years the books on it are so old but i found it and i started reading this book called the darkness outside us because it was like two dollars or something and i was talking to my sister about how much i like it and she bought it on amazon um and she's ahead of me now okay so today we're gonna have to read a lot because obviously she's reading faster than me if she was able to buy it get it and get it ahead of me so my goal is to finish before her that's my goal that's all i have to say i'm gonna read right now hello this is a voiceover but around one o'clock i started making lunch and i had this vision so at trader joe's there's this chicken salad and it's like curry sweet it's really good and i wanted to try to make something similar but with chickpeas so that's what i did i just mashed chickpeas with avocado curry powder and salt and then mixed in celery raisins and green onion one thing is i would do mayonnaise instead of avocado but it was so good anyways and it really gave me like the vibe of the chicken salad i just put it on some toast with hot honey I put hot honey on everything and it was delicious. Hello, it is now almost three o'clock. I've spent most of the day outside reading actually. 
yeah i'm probably gonna read more actually i'm probably gonna watch some youtube and turn my air conditioning on it's hot in here okay i will see you later ago and then I took a shower but I want to talk about the book I'm reading right now earlier I think I said something about like trying to get ahead of my sister that didn't happen but I have read more today and it is so good it's called the darkness outside us by Elliot um Skurfer. I really butchered that last name I will put it on screen um it is so good though Pretty much it's set in like 2500 so like way in the future the world is like kind of slowly deteriorating and in a few years you won't be able to survive on it so they sent a girl to saturn's moon to see if humans could survive there something happened they like lost contact with her so a couple years later they sent two more people up and one of them is her brother to see if she's still alive and also still see if saturn's moon is survivable if that's a word um but like it's crazy right now i think i'm like 150 pages in or something it is there's so many plot twists it's so good it's also like a romance between the two boys that they sent up later um and it's it's so good okay like please go read it it was also $2 on Kindle, and my sister got the paperback. I think the paperback was like $10. Just go get it, okay? It's incredible. It's written so well. It's so interesting. There's so many plot twists. And also because it's set in like 2,500, it's very like techy. It's so cool, okay? I've never read anything like it, but yeah, wanted to say that. Um, but yeah, I think I'm going to sign off the video here. So thank you for hanging out with me pretty much because I did not hang out with anyone else. See ya! Yeah.